My dear friends, I am Maksud here from Aftari Classes. I will be the instructor for AWS training at Aftari Classes. And today we have an introductory session on to cloud computing with respect to AWS. So by the way, in this session, I would like to explain you something basics. What is AWS? AWS stands for Amazon Web Services. When most of the people might be aware what is AWS. AWS stands for Amazon Web Service. And you might be aware that AWS is the number one cloud provider in the world. Now I can say cloud service provider in the world. Okay, Amazon Web Service, they are the cloud service provider in the world. Now what do you understand by the term cloud? As you all are aware, that cloud computing is in demand but many people are not aware what is cloud computing we will have a detailed discussion in our syllabus about what is cloud computing not to worry but i would like to give you a basic idea about cloud computing see cloud computing is a service model like you see that amazon aws amazon web services they are giving you multiple services and cloud computing is a service model how you can relate the term amazon web service cloud computing is a service model what is the meaning of cloud what is the meaning of service model i will give you a basic idea see in earlier days if a company requires servers they will buy physical servers they will install os they will install application they will install os they install application now on one server they require os but they don't want application they want to install database they will install database and a company will say i am having three servers but what has changed nowadays to keep three server you require space you require power you require racks you require cooling and to manage the server you require manpower also on your site to avoid these things people are going for a simpler solution what is a simpler solution that amazon has created aws started the operation in 2006 what they did till now what is aws doing aws has built many data center large scale data center across the world in different parts of the world and what they are doing amazon is having a server they are installing the os for you if you want a server with database installed they will give you a ready-made os windows linux you want an oracle database ready-made you want a database server with microsoft sql installed my dear friends you get windows server you can get linux server you can get oracle database my sql database everything you get from amazon as a service amazon web service you go to the amazon website that website is nothing but aws.amazon.com you go over here and there is an option sign in to console when you say sign in to console it will ask you to create a new account whenever you create an account with aws this account which you create for the first time in your life that account becomes a free tier account which gives you access to many paid services mark my words many paid services 100 percent free for 12 months so that's the reason remember when atari classes delivers the training we deliver online trainings but remember you get a feeling of classroom in online training getting a feeling of classroom how it is possible remember my dear friends every candidate will be creating a free tier account where you get 12 months of access for many services 100 percent free once you create an account you sign up now what is the benefit you can do live practicals with the trainer so the benefit is that my dear friends when you come to atari classes when you come to atari classes and you join any course i'm specifically talking about aws course you will be performing live practicals with the trainer 
okay now when i say live practicals with the trainer what is the benefit you are able to perform and you are able to learn the things quickly why because you are performing live practicals with the trainer other thing is that if you want to revise at your home if you want to do the practicals you have access to your free tier account which you have created for 12 months you can do practice again and again free of charge and to support your practice we have a learning management system which is included for free with every course what is lms lms will give you access to live recorded topic wise lecture you will get notes and multiple things in lms using that lectures you can revise and you can do the practicals again and again and when you are live performing practicals with the trainer if you face any issues consider you are not able to perform the practicals in that case what will happen in that case my dear friend you are if you are not able to perform live practicals with the trainer trainer that is myself maksud shekha <laughs> okay i will take remote of your system and help you out okay so that those people who are not able to understand something or they are not able to do the practical strainer will take remote of your system and will solve your issues and you will be able to perform practical live with the trainer this is all about what is aws and i have given you a basic idea what is cloud now when you create an account on amazon website amazon is giving you over the website i have shown you the website now everything is available as a service what is available as a service remember my dear friend this data center server is created in amazon data center database is installed in amazon data center but if it's a windows server you can take rdp of your windows server. remote if it's a linux server you can take remote access of your server using ssh if you have a database server you can take access of your database server and you can use what is the benefit this is a service model why the cloud model is known as service model because if you use server for one hour you pay for one hour if you use database for one week you pay for one week if you use for one year you pay for one year but remember if you use for 30 minutes or one hour or two hour you pay only for the amount you are using so remember my dear friend in simple words i can say when you go for aws cloud amazon is giving you everything over the website as a service it means over their website you can access different data centers of the world now amazon is having around 80 plus data centers in the world you can access any of the data center of the world you can create a server consider you create a server in uk you are charged for uk server consider you create a server in mumbai you are charged for mumbai server no need to buy the server no need to manage the server no need to install operating system everything is managed by amazon this model where amazon manages everything and you pay only if you are using okay this is also known as service model or in simple words this model is known as pay as you go model so everybody has understood now what is cloud model cloud is nothing but a pay as you go model it is also known as service model so you use the service you pay the charge you use the server you use storage you use network you pay the charge now when we talk about aws syllabus my dear friend the complete aws syllabus is given on our website we will talk with the basics about aws once we start the syllabus and then we will discuss multiple things and you will be after the discussion is done every topic we will go ahead and do the practicals whichever topic practicals are applicable and after completing the course your concepts will be crystal clear and you can start working as a cloud architect in any of the companies wherever there are vacancies available so remember my dear friend once you complete the aws cloud course this course is what this course is aws cloud solution architect course level is associate aws cloud solution architect course associate level just to give you an idea who should join this course 
Anyone can join the course? No, my dear friends. There are some prerequisites. <laughs> Nobody can join any course. Remember, a person who has knowledge about system, system means servers like Windows, Linux, or a person belonging to a database profile, or a storage guy, or a network guy. Those people who want to who are into IT infra domain and they want to make a career in cloud computing. They can go for this course. Other than the senior people like team leads, tech leads, project, project managers, program managers, those people who are leading IT infra team, they should also be aware about cloud. So this course is basically an AWS solution architect course. Okay, hopefully sometimes in life we will meet either in a classroom training or in online training. Take care, bye-bye.